I cleaned out this wheel well from that. I don't know what it was, but um, as best I could, I spent way too much time on it. And I'm just cleaning the crumbs and wiping this down because I bought some sound deadening mat to lay down because it is a lot more noisy and Ace is helping. Right, Mr. AC boy? So what I decided to try out, putting the donut up on top of my roof rack because I really don't like getting into, well, my roof basket. Uh, it's just, it's kind of a hassle. And so maybe this tire with other recovery gear like my boards, my shovel, are better up here as opposed to like my hiking pack, uh, toilet. I already moved my toilet to my Exo Swim Base gear locker, but I think I might try that out and it, the solar panel will still shut just fine. Uh, just we'll have to screw it down. And I wish I would have attached these up higher because I could have fit things underneath better, but this is what we are working with currently. We are gonna take a little break from this video and test drive a Ford Transit cargo van because I am planning on buying it. It's gonna be a special order. Medium roof, 148 wheelbase and with some nice bells and whistles. So I'm out here at the Ken Garf in West Valley, Ken Garf Ford in West Valley, because they have vans available to test drive in the size that I'm looking for. And then we may end up special ordering one today. So I'm an appointment in like one minute. So I need to get inside and get this going. I'm in my new car. I actually came to get a Bronco. So this is the Bronco Sport and it's actually not as small as I thought. No, I'm just kidding. This is a, in the showroom. So what we're doing currently is ordering my van. Uh, the salesperson, Courtney, who is helping me, said that she ordered a Ford Transit passenger van for a customer and it took 22 months. I was like, oh! No. Cargo vans should take be faster. I was like, I've been hearing six months and Simon, I believe his name is, said that he just ordered a van and he was told four to six months. So hopefully I'm in that same time frame and I didn't even need to worry about getting pre-approved like I was doing because the thousand dollars just, you know, locks you in. And typically I was like, well, what if I have a 200 credit score? And she was like, well, people who pay put down a thousand dollars, they're legitimate and we're not really worried about it. So we'll run all the credit and stuff, um, beforehand. And I was pre-approved through USAA and I was like, do you want me to send you that? And they're like, no. I was like, what the freak? I need, I ran my credit for nothing. So Simon was smarter than me. The thousand dollar deposit is to order it. And once you have a build date, it is no longer a refundable deposit. So I am ordering the carbonized gray, medium roof, long wheelbase, 148, 250, uh, EcoBoost with the RV package, has swivel seats, and I'm ordering it with the windows in the doors in the back, a window um, in the passenger sliding door and I am ordering like the 360 camera, the shelf, dual alternator and some other bells and whistles. And I feel like that'll be a good, um, those will be good options for me. So I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. I can't, I can't believe I'm doing this. I saw the Astro van, what, two weeks ago. And now I'm ordering a, a Ford Transit brand new cargo van. Here we go. So now we'll cut back to the video that I was working on, finishing out the kill mat. This car's beeping at me. Finishing out the kill mat, 
and um just getting like a setup going because i decided i'm going to camp in it before i figure out like the build build and that's what i'm going to do with the ford transit first is camp in it more camp in it initially and see how i want the layout so we'll go on some camping trips with just like the bare bones fridge sitting on the floor battery sitting on the floor ace and me and go for it so we'll come back to that finishing up that that uh point of the car and then um come back then the other videos will be camping in a bare bones build okay see you later bye